Hey guys, this is Rye123 here. Welcome to your fifth Roblox tutorial. Let's see, so we did exploring guy. Yeah, fifth. <laughs> Sorry. Um, and today we're going to be making a trampoline. Now, this doesn't require any scripting actually, even though it may sound like it will be, but it it doesn't actually it just um means that we edit some properties that i showed you in the last video um so let's to start off let's just like always come over here get a brick let's use a wooden brick this time we always use a green brick and just chuck it on the ground make it a so it's one by one and then just pull it down so it's as short as it can go we're gonna make four of these spaced about four studs in between them remember just control C control V to paste then paste a fifth one put it on top and drag it across so that it kinda looks like a trampoline then we're going to change this so it looks a little bit more like a trampoline top. So just come over here. Let's just make it black and plastic so that it looks smooth. And then we're going to come down here to our surface and make it smooth also. Then we're going to come up here and select all of our trampoline parts and anchor them so that it doesn't fall over when we jump on it now if once you've done all that go ahead and click on the top part of the trampoline and come over to the properties again sorry and see this one velocity velocity is a property um whatever like it just like basically moves things so if you've ever played someone else's game where they have like a conveyor belt they're probably using the velocity property at either X or Z um, if you think back to if you think to your math class if you're in a high enough math class for graphing if you remember a graph um, X is always right and left and Y is always up and down. Z is just a third dimensional axis which is frontwards and backwards. Um, since we're making a trampoline we're going to want to go up so just take your Y which is up and down and let's just set it to 50 for now and see what happens. So we're going to come over here remember tools, test, play solo wait for our player to load taking a while cuz I'm recording yours shouldn't take this long unless you have a crappy computer and just from last video see we can go through this told you it would work and then see we made a trampoline just by editing them some properties it wasn't that hard if you change the let's just do it in here if you come into workspace find your top trampoline part you can come in here change the velocity note that this will not save your to your file just because it's a visit um, but you can still like edit stuff let's change it to 100 and see what happens oops wrong button that's why I'm pushing shift as you can see now we jump a lot higher and let's get really crazy here let's try Y set to um, 200 see what happens Now, I think there's a certain limit to how high you can go before your guy will fall through the ground because he jumps too high. So let's just try it. Let's try like 450, see if we can find that limit just for fun. Do you think we're going to fall through? Here, let's just land on the ground. Oh, I guess not. All right, fine. You want to play 
Hardball. Let's go 1,000. Sorry, I'm just kind of having fun here. <laughs> oh, yes. Hmm. That's weird. I guess they took it away. You used to be able to fall through the base play all the time. Look at that. We're like gaining high each time. It looks like we haven't reached our terminal velocity. <laughs> I guess it's pretty high to jump off the map. Oh well. Let's just set it to 5,000 for one last hurrah. And then I think we'll end it off. This was just a short video to show you guys how to make a trampoline. Well, why don't we just like make a conveyor belt while we're at it? So, if we stop jumping, there we go. Just, stupid, just come over here, set the, here, let me show you, set the Y back to zero and just put the X to like 25 and then when we get on it we'll just get pushed off the side and that's how you make a conveyor belt if you wanted to go wow if you wanted to go the other way you would just put negative 25 and you would go to the right and then if you wanted to go this way or this way you would just use the Z positive or negative and so that's all for this video, guys. Um, be sure to stay tuned for the next one. So subscribe, leave us a like, and a comment if you have any questions. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Thanks.